how we're starting our morning. Oh my gosh, it is so close. So that was pretty cool seeing this morning, that hot air balloon. That was one way to start our day. There is another hot air balloon up there. Mm -hmm. We are heading to New York this morning for the baby shower. Um, but we're going a little bit early. The baby shower is not until four. Um, and we're, it's like 6.46 in the morning May, right now. May, May. We're gonna pick everybody up by seven. We're gonna go get some Dunkin' Donuts and then we're gonna drive up. Like I said yesterday, it takes about four hours really? to get there. Yeah, it's a long drive, baby girl. May, May, May. But we're gonna make like a little road trip out of it. So I'm picking up my mom now and then I'm picking up my friend Amber, picking up my aunt and her boyfriend and then my cousins are also following us in their car because they have their Mom, little boy with them. Some watermelons for Babu because they're <laughs> I didn't pack any watermelon, honey, but we're gonna stop for some breakfast when we get the family, okay? Um, so we're gonna go and get some New York pizza because we'll get there around lunchtime. Yeah, I really and then love my pizza. I know, we'll try to find some white pizza for you. And then, oh look, another hot air balloon. Where? Do you see it straight ahead? Um, what? Do you see it? Yeah, I see the color. That one's a little farther away, but I've that always one's wanted to do. Too, like the other one. Mm -hmm. I've always wanted to do hot air balloon rides. Like that's definitely on my bucket list. Maybe next year, I don't know. We'll see. Um, but yeah, I'm super excited. You know, once I'm with family, I really don't like being on the camera too, too much, but I do love visiting New York. So I'll get a couple clips of our trip, oh, you know, here and there. That. That's okay, we're fast, they're slow. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm excited to see how today goes. I am utterly exhausted. I went I'll out just last look night. For another air balloon. Yeah, keep, it's actually a different color. keep your eyes out for some more hot air balloons. There's usually a yellow smiley face one too. Um, Wait, over there, look it. I don't see it, baby. No, that cloud, I'm staring at that cloud. <laughs> <laughs> you see. Um, Last night we went out and I didn't get to sleep until like 1.10 in the morning. And then I woke up at five <laughs> to get keep ready. Keep your ears so, open and eyes out. Yeah, keep your, keep your eyes open and your ears out. <laughs> um, so hopefully I won't be the only one driving to New York because to be honest, I would love to catch a nap on our way there. What's so up, baby? Out, out to Mimi we saw two air balloons. It was Keep them fill up on gas too, but I'll do that then, when I pick up my mom. Um, yeah, we, uh, what so, about the hot air balloon? What? Oh yeah, you gotta tell Mimi about the hot air balloon. I mean, actually the two uh, hot air balloons went past us. Yeah, but maybe we'll see another one. But you gotta keep your eyes open, okay? Yeah. Oh, there, there's, there's there it is! <laughs> the big smiley one! Oh, it's behind the trees, but do you see the yellow over there? Do you kind of see it? Yeah, I kind of see it. Oh, I, it's I, hiding behind the tree. I knew there's a big smiley one. That's so funny. We've seen three of them. I think there's usually only three every time that I've seen them. I mean, there's a lot of air balloons in town. Yeah. Would you ever want to go up on a hot air balloon? No, there's people in the basket. It was just, that one was really hard to see because it was behind a lot of trees. But I just saw the eye in the mouth. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, guys, we will, uh, after I pick up my family, I will talk to you guys in a little bit. I'm so yeah. excited for our trip to Baby. New York. I called chocolate, chocolate Mimi and she said there's a fire. Let's go see.
to school with clothes shopping. <laughs> um, honestly, the majority of our stuff we've gotten already. Oh, this is cute. I know it's for like school uniforms, but it's still cute. Really, I just need like a rain jacket, a light jacket, shoes, definitely. That's my main Mom, goal here. Yes, baby. Dress, I can get that. Oh, very cute. We don't need any more dresses. We need sweaters not like zip up sweaters not pullover sweaters but like cute knitted sweaters for the fall so we'll see what we can get i think i'm in the right section how are you cold it's like a million bajillion degrees out today all right let's see what we can find mm. all right so we pretty much found what we needed for the most part i found a bunch of sets i will be recording the haul i think this upcoming wednesday because her backpack and stuff just got delivered too Hang on, mommy, I want to start the car. It's still hot out. Not as bad, but it's still hot out. Come a little closer to me, baby. So yeah, for the most part, I only found one shoe, <laughs> which is what I was going there for. All right, baby, you can hop in this. It's not bad and it'll cool down quick. They didn't really have a crazy shoe selection. I have to get her some sneakers and some flats. But to be honest, I'm probably just going to go to Walmart um, and get those for her because she grows so quickly that I don't want to spend a lot of money. But I did get her one pair of shoes and then I found her warm clothes, which I really wanted, but I found her set. So like they came with pants, some came with a jacket and like a long sleeve. So that was really awesome as well. I also found her some socks, some tights that she needed. So like the last thing I think as of right now is just like a raincoat um, and then I get her her winter jacket a little bit later just to make sure that I get the right size so a hundred dollars later but I got a lot of stuff for a hundred bucks and that's why I like going here um, so you'll see everything during the back to school haul because I have school supplies too and everything so we are gonna head out of here I don't know what the heck we're gonna do for dinner oh well I was gonna say let me show you guys we stopped at uh Bath and Body Works, like first thing this morning. And I got two new candles and I wanted to show them to you guys. I hope they didn't melt because they've been in the car all day. But I feel like candles have like that melting point they have to get to. So hopefully they're not melted already. Um, but I got two, fla two flavors, hello, two scents. And they're amazing. But I'll share that with you guys when we get home because I can't, I already pulled out <laughs> forgetting to show you. Uh, and you that's guys, okay. What's up, baby? And my cat on me right here. Oh. Arrow only claws you if you play with him because he thinks that you're playing with him. Right? I have the right of way. You know what? Oh, baby. Arrow caught me on the knee. He got you on the knee? Yeah. Well, what were you doing to him? Arrow doesn't cloth for no reason. Hmm? What were you doing to Mr. Arrow to make him claw you, huh? Uh, rough with him. Yeah, you were playing rough with him. Oh, one other thing real quick. Um, I ended up contacting... I'm just rolling these up a little bit. I ended up contacting her school via Facebook, actually. Because it's really convenient, like, schools will have their Facebooks. I have the app to, like, keep up to date with what's going on, like, on a day-to-day -day basis. Like, I could log on anytime and see what event is happening. Um, but they also have, like, a Facebook, and they'll post, like, events and stuff. Um, we actually have, like, a movie night under the stars, I think, August 14th. And then we have the back-to-school cookout. So I ended up emailing them because when I went to orientation for her school, they said that there would be a fall open house answering any more questions. So the fall open house isn't until September. So I'm like, well, I don't know what to do for the first day of school. <laughs> like, I don't know. Like I tried signing her up for school lunches probably last week, but then they said that like I need a student. Oh, I need a student. All right, sorry, our parked car scared the poop out of me they needed like a, a student ID that was provided by the school and I'm like well I haven't gotten that yet so like I, you know I just started kind of freaking out because this is my first time doing this 
um, but they said that they're supposed to be sending this was like last week that this week they're supposed to be sending out a letter in the mail at the beginning beginning of the week like explaining what to expect on the first day so hopefully that put my mind at ease a little bit sorry my camera doesn't want to stop adjusting but I don't know I'm just nervous like it'll be so much easier with this one like when this one is is going to school because I would have already done it I also overthink everything but like you guys we only have like three more weeks until she's in school and I'm not gonna know what to do with myself <laughs> I don't know what to do I mean I'm gonna take the opportunity because like I'm still a stay-at-home mom so like you know I'll drop her off in the morning get my chores done what the heck is going on up here um but then like I'm hoping to be able to dedicate more time to YouTube like not just doing my vlogs but like being able i don't know being able to go out like trying do like you guys really really liked the i try i let a stranger like pick what i eat when i went into a drive-thru like i i would like to do another one of those like stuff like that i guess to keep myself busy and preoccupied because i have like i've never had this you know oh my goodness just when you thought baby open the door <laughs> just shut the door on me baby open the door Yeah, you beat me. Okay. Give me one second and I'll get you strawberries, okay? Oh, I got some chores to do. Yeah, I gotta do the dishes. I gotta mop. We're just gonna order some white pizza tonight for dinner. I gotta mop and I gotta put a basket of laundry away. But here's the bag full of her um, clothes that we just got today. So that can go away till Wednesday. Oh, wait a minute. I wonder if her package was delivered yet. I'll go check that. I'll go check in one second. No worries. Let me get her strawberries. Hold on. Okay, I just got her hooked up with some strawberries and fed my cat. Um, I just checked my Amazon thing because they deliver it in such a weird spot, but it's not here yet. But let me show you quickly what I got at Bath & Body. Um, so I honestly really like getting these single wick candles because I feel like you can get like more scents and stuff. So they always have them for like two for 18. So one of them I restocked up on. And if you have a woman in your life that likes candles, my friend Amber, I walked into her house one day and she had a candle burning and I'm like, that smells so good. Like, what is it? It was so classy and so fresh. And it's this. And I, you can tell, <laughs> I already went through it. But it's called Champagne Toast. It is, oh, it is amazing. It is so, so good. It's so classy. I even went to Bath & Body probably like a week, a week and a half ago with Amber, my mom, Ella, and I. I didn't buy anything because like I wasn't there to buy anything. We actually was there to stop at charming charlie's before they went uh before they closed down so i didn't buy anything at the time but my mom bought like a little wall plug-in and she was looking at the scents and she's like oh what scent do i get and i said is it for a woman i have the perfect scent for you and they had it in like a wall plug-in too so if you're not like if you have like animals and stuff don't want to do candles they have the plug-in too but then i was so in the mood for fall fall is my favorite season i love the summer i love the warmth but like nothing beats fall for me so i bought <laughs> i bought my favorite fall candle tj hates this candle <laughs> tj hates this candle but i love it and it's called and it's called leaves oh my god it's like if somebody can you smell it yeah, if somebody it smells really like pineapples. Like pineapple. Oh my god. Like this is what, if somebody could take the season of fall and package it into a candle, this is what. Oh this is god. like, this is like. It is so good. I can't, it just smells like crispy leaves. Like death and decay. It's amazing. <laughs> I love this one, but I am going to save this one until the end of this month. Soon, excuse me. You have a whole dish. She's like, no, I'm not. I didn't get to rinse this one, silly. Here, Thank now you. you can eat it. But I just gave you. She wanted me to put it in her. <laughs> Don't eat the green part, though. <laughs> um, I am gonna save it till like right back to school. You know when it's appropriate to uh 
burn these but this one is absolutely amazing and it might not be everybody's cup of tea but like I think I smelled this one probably two years ago and every single year I have gotten this one again and then again champagne pop I almost said champagne pop champagne toast is one that I kind of like burn year round so I just want to show you that the package that's coming in actually has Ella's backpack in it little shorts for her like biker shorts to go underneath um uh, dresses and stuff and then it just has like backdrop clips so, mommy where's your bowl of strawberries <laughs> so it's nothing like too exciting so i might just show you like the backdrop clips i use in case you want to get one of your own i don't know i found them on amazon super cheap um but yeah i have a bunch of chores to do and i'm gonna order some pizza really soon for lunch so dinner so i need my phone for that i love you guys <laughs>